Today I'm making homemade caramel popcorn. To make the popcorn, pour your vegetable oil into your pan and give it a swirl to make sure the bottom has a nice light coating of the oil. Add a couple of the kernels into the oil on a medium heat and when you start to see little bubbles fizz around the corn, that's when you know your oil is hot enough. Add the rest of the kernels and give the pan a good shake to make sure they get a nice coating of the oil and then cover with a lid. From here it will take about two to three minutes for the popping to begin. Once it starts popping, make sure to give your pan a shake every so often to keep the popcorn moving and to stop any of it from burning. gets a bit steamy, let some air in to stop the popcorn from getting soggy. Take your pan off the heat when the popping begins to slow down, as we don't want to overcook the popcorn, and then the remaining kernels should carry on popping with the heat of the pan. Tip your popcorn into some large bowls to cool. To make the caramel, add your butter into a heavy base saucepan, followed by your caster sugar and two tablespoons of honey. Give this a stir on a medium heat until the butter and sugar has dissolved and it is all melted together. Wipe down the sides of the pan with water to prevent any of the sugar crystallising on the edges. Bring it to a boil on a medium high heat and cook for three to five minutes until it turns a golden caramel colour, making sure you do not stir. Once you've reached your caramel colour, take it off the heat and pour half over half of your popcorn and using two spatulas, as the caramel will be very hot, toss the popcorn to give it a good covering of the caramel. Pour onto a baking tray with parchment paper or anything to stop it from sticking and spread it out and leave to cool. Repeat with your second half. Once your popcorn has cooled, break up any of the bigger chunks of popcorn and serve. So that's homemade caramel popcorn. Easy. For more videos, subscribe to my channel. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and feel free to leave any requests in the comment box below.